So previously we had a power supply installed with this controller as a standard hookup. Mm -hmm. Now we're going to do it as a transmitted power supply hookup. Okay. So for the transmitted hookup, we're going to take the black and black from our power supply wire and our light, well, our light wire. Over here, jumping over to here. Then our home run wire, we'll take that in with it, crimp them together. And that's home run to the first light. Yep. And then we're going to take our green wire from the home run. Going out to the first We light. would have a light out there. Which is going to be over... 75 feet. 75 feet or roughly there about. Right. And we're going to put it in the green port. And then from there, we would have a receiver on the end of that line. Okay. Here's our still light. That still has light on it. <laughs> yeah. And we're going to do color for color. You've got your four wires on your receiver. They go to your four wires on your home run. And white to white. Red. So not to make you feel uncomfortable, but is it easier doing it standing here at a table or easier on the outside of the house? <clears throat> Definitely at a table. <laughs> Half the time you're sliding off a roof while you're doing this. So. And then green to green. Sliding on a roof, not off. Sliding on the roof, yeah. Never, nobody's ever slid off the roof yet. Okay. And then our light's mm -hmm. facing the flow of the power. Okay, so to recap, basically what we did is we took, rather than combining our green to our black, so combining the ground, we've got red and black coming from the secondary power supply. And then going out to your first light, your home run, you've got white and green. White is your standard communication, green is your transmitted communication. Going out to the end of the line, about 75 feet out or more, connecting to a four wire, red, green, black, white, and then out to a three wire to a light. Making sure your light's pointed in the right direction. Very good. Awesome, thank you. Yep.